last game in a series of very many games. Are you satisfied about this one? Yes, I'm satisfied. Uh, we had a, we had a one cyclus with eight games in a very short period. Uh, we didn't start it well. This cyclus, we, we had the two defeats, and but after that, uh, I think that we got the good rhythm. We won uh, six games in a row, and what is more important for me that the team was performing better than in the beginning. So. Uh, we are showing a certain progress and for me as a coach that's very important. Yeah, but it's too bad you lost those two games against big opponents. Yes, that's something what will stay our goal now uh, after uh, in November because in November we have, a, we have a tough schedule. Euro Challenge is starting, we have a game away in Den Helder, we have a game away in Den Bosch and game, game home against Leiden. So these are games. Uh, where we will uh, need to confirm these good performances and where we have to show again certain progression. Back to the game against Ares, it was a big difference. You've seen Ares before, of course, but what, what did, did you think about the team tonight? Uh, it's not me to judge the opposite team. I, I really think that, uh, that the team of Ares is dangerous. I saw two, two of their games, they are very athletic. Uh, I'm very happy with the things we did tonight. Uh, I think that we played very good defense, especially in the beginning. And uh, we made a huge lead already in the first quarter. And that's something what helped us because the uh, opposite team, they didn't have enough confidence after that. And I would say that it was uh, just a question of a difference, uh, how many we will win. Um, now you got some time off, at least off of games. So what are you going to do now? Recover with the team? We, we first of all, I want to give a two days off to everybody because uh, in 18 days we have seven games. So that it was really exhausted. And, and you know that we are struggling from the beginning of the season with injuries. So JD could not play tonight. Uh, we, we, out of our nine, let's say, starters, if we can say that, we have seven of them for the moment. Also, some other players like Q is already playing with this kind of a foot injury for a long time. We have some other people. Uh, Ross is bothered by, by his thumb and that I'm not going now player by player. So it's a very important that they have a good rest in these two days. And after that, I, I, I hope that some players will be back, that we can organize our practices. Because the uh, problem is that uh, we could not practice and, and to work on a certain things because we haven't been complete. And we have always nine, ten players with the juniors and our rhythm on the, on the practice is something what was not good. And that's, I hope that, that after this some people can join us and that we can do a better job on a practice and that we can continue our progression on the games. Beckering, 23 points, 12 rebounds, 5 blocks. What happened tonight? Uh, you know, I think we just had a lot of energy, especially in the first quarter. And then, uh, you know, we got a lot of easy hoops as a team. Uh, you know, for me personally, my teammates were able to find me in, in you know, really easy situations. And that helps you kind of get, you know, on a roll. And uh, I think especially our defensive pressure, that turned into a lot of easy transition buckets for us. So I think it was a good effort. It looked like in the beginning of the game that Arvin said something to you. And that from that moment on, you got every one-on-one -on -one to the basket. Uh, yeah. I don't, I don't really remember anything specifically, but I mean, I enjoy playing with Arvin, that's for sure. I, I know he found me quite a few times for, for, uh, for some buckets, so uh, yeah, I think it was just a good effort for our whole team. I mean, the, the whole idea, you know, tonight was to bring it, you know, energy defensively, and that turned into a lot of easy buckets. You know, tonight it was more, you know, I got a lot of opportunities, but it might be someone else another night, so. We have to go back 10 years that we've had more than two alley-oops in one game. What's happening here? Uh, you know, I guess it's something for the crowd. You know, and obviously we had the chances to do that tonight. I think that, that came, comes back to what I said, you know, defensively, us putting a lot of pressure on them. And, uh, you know, I think that's nice for, you know, the people who are watching the game. But uh, we know that's not, you know, that's not a really big thing in the, in the, in the long, long term scope of things. So, but it is a nice thing and it gives us energy, you know, to see your teammates make different plays like that. So uh, I think, you know, from the reaction, people enjoyed it and hopefully we can bring that a little more. I probably can say you had a slow start this season. It's getting better and better. What made the difference? What, what happened with you? Uh, I think, you know, the mentality just has to be to keep going. I mean, you know, I, I take this job very professionally, and I think our team does as well. 
you know, and it's just a matter of getting used to new systems and new players and just trusting, you know, that the hard work you put in, you know, every day, whether it's in training or, you know, outside the court is going to pay off eventually. So for me, uh, personally, it's just a matter of, you know, keeping my focus and keep doing the things, you know, that I've been doing in the past. And uh, I know that, you know, things are going to come around. And, and yeah, that's the key is just to stay, stay positive and keep putting that energy in and keep moving forward. You're the man of the match. Did you have a nice night? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's always great to play in Martini, and uh, especially with the energy tonight, uh, something I really enjoy. And then just, you know, with my teammates as well, I had to give a lot of credit to them. It's just, it just makes it fun, you know, the energy that we brought tonight. It, uh, you know, it really rubs off, and that's something that I enjoy. So. We too. Thank you, Roz. Yeah, thank you.